hello people welcome back to my channel on this channel i talk about faith lifestyle i also review books and magazine my name is fisayel if you are new to my channel thank you for stopping by i do not take your um clicking <laughs> you know this video for granted thank you so much you might want to consider um subscribing liking and sharing this video before you leave if you're not new to my channel thank you so much for your continued support i do not take any one of you for granted i'm very very deeply 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 grateful so today i am going to be featuring an amazing lady <laughs> she has a fantastic story behind you know uh um starting a product starting a business that sort of thing and she is going to be sharing her story on this channel i am going to leave um i put a click i'm gonna leave a link in my description box just so you know where to look for her on our website so you can get some of this natural hair product but before then this is what the uh, a box actually looks like. So when I ordered the product from her, it came in this beautiful, beautiful box. And it has so many lovely things in there. Uh, that's just packaging. Um, I only got three products from her, but I'm sure there are many more on our website. If you click on the link, you will find out a bit more. That is one of them. So the extra shin extra sheen mango butter queen so this is very very beautiful smells amazing you can tell i've <laughs> been using it for a long time and uh, it's all natural product and um it's actually very um shiny so if you leave it on your on your hair and it's a very hot day it's just gonna melt into your hair your hair is gonna soak in all the goodness and i also got this aloe vera rose and this is just a gel souffle and if you just want maybe if you've just finished washing your hair and you just want it maybe like a wash and go sort of thing you can add it to your hair and but my hair is not that long so i don't really use this as much because I don't do wash and go usually <laughs> I, I mean if my hair was long then maybe I would like to use it a bit more just to get it down and also I've also heard that you can use it to detangle just before you wash your natural hair and another thing I got is the herbal energizer vital yeah vitalizer and it's we can tell nearly finished it all the herbal goodness are kind of in the in the bottom of the in, in the bottom of the bottle and it's got two um, it's got the lid i mean yeah the cap which is easy you can you can you can see there yeah let me just um you can see what it looks like very clear and the thing is it just you know just sinks in into your hair the smell it's very herbal earthy smell it's not kind of perfumey because it's all natural product and usually usually when i have this product is um when i've just washed my hair so usually i wash my hair once a week or yeah once in two weeks depending on how i'm feeling and or how much product i have in my hair because obviously you need to keep your scalp very very clean but that is very good for scalp as well but there are so many other products on uh, uh on our website there's a afro cap and so many other things and the hair massager so many things on the on our website so if you haven't reached out to our, our social media handles i'm going to post it here as well and you can just go and find her she's such an amazing young lady who has you know brought um an amazing thing out of lockdown so you know some of us had the lockdown happen not even some of us all of us had lockdown and it was during the lockdown she started her story she started this business so let's listen to mercy's main mercy's main hi everyone it's mercy here and i am the founder of mercy's main so if you don't already know mercy's main is a natural hair business and we make natural hair products to help support you in maintaining healthy afro curly textured hair 
So I started my business in 2020, so during the um, lockdown for the COVID-19 pandemic. And since launching, it's been a whirlwind. Um, you know, it's taken off more than I kind of imagined that it would. And I'm just very happy for all the support um, and love that I've received from all my lovely um, customers, family and friends. So essentially how I started my business, well, I was just making my um, hair oil, which is one of the products um, that I first launched with. And I usually make this oil to help with strengthening my hair. And as I was making it, I decided to give the excess to my mom because um, I actually made more than I needed. And she tried out the oil and she absolutely loved it. She was seeing a lot of improvement in her hair. And she was getting a lot of um, compliments from her colleagues at work. So I was thinking, okay, well, I can actually um, make this so that more people can have it and more people can try it. So that's how I started really um, with the idea that I can turn this into like a business and be able to just reach a lot more people um, with my natural hair products and the one thing about me is that uh, people always used to ask me about my hair and what I'm doing to take care of it so I just thought that this was also going to be a nice way to also like help to support people in their hair journeys help to encourage people especially because I wasn't the type of natural who would be doing too much to the hair so I don't actually do that much to my hair um, so it's it you know it just was perfect for me to sh encourage people and tell people look hey you know you can just use natural stuff in your hair and um, your hair can you know flourish and be the best that it can be so that's how I started and um, uh, you know it took me a while obviously because from the idea to actually launching there was a lot of things that I had to do um, a lot of processes that I had to um, go through so um, I had to get my certificates and all that and basically just set up for being able to ship products to people um, because obviously we were still in a lockdown so I had to figure out a way of how I was going to do this package it and make sure that it just people can just order and then it just arrives straight to their doorstep so that's how I started really and then I started also um, sharing my behind the scenes on TikTok and one video that I made went viral and um, so many people saw it. it even caught the attention of people from America as well so then that's pretty much what put me on the map and yeah when I launch you know I had I, I mean I have international customers and yeah as I said it's just been a blessing ever since so whilst preparing um, for my launch and you know putting things in place and stuff you know I often felt discouraged um, at the time I wasn't working so I was able to dedicate all of my time and effort and energy into building this um, business and what I loved the most was that there were several different aspects to it. Um, so it meant that, you know, each day I can devote my time to different things. But I often felt very overwhelmed. And as I said, I felt like, especially when I started to get viral on social media, you know, the pressure was there. Like, oh, when are you releasing the products um, and stuff like that? And, you know, seeing other big brands out there that people are already familiar with. You know I started to feel like oh no like you know maybe this is a bit you know out of my depth here so one verse that really encouraged me was Proverbs chapter 31 verses 16 so I have it open here so I'm just gonna read it and it says she considers a field and buys it with the fruit of her hands she plants a vineyard and this verse just really spoke to me and really encouraged me because it was literally like speaking about my position and essentially what I basically gained from this verse was that you know out of what looks like you know nothing um, you know I've seen an opportunity you know God is going to bless the fruit of my labor 
and out of it will be a vineyard so and that's exactly like that's my testimony because that's exactly what happened so out of literally nothing from my kitchen um you know me just whipping up products is now blossomed and it's become um a booming business so yeah that's pretty much my story um and obviously i will be running up to one year since launching since launching there have been a lot that has changed um so at the moment i'm preparing the brand to basically expand and um be more unisex so to also cater for men as well men's afro curly textured hair um and also just to kind of polish off the brand because as i said i literally did everything for by myself when starting but now since starting um i'm able to like delegate and to work with other amazing individuals and freelancers um to help make the brand the best that it can be so i've outsourced various things like you know getting my professional um a logo done and you know getting getting certain things done by different various professionals um which has been great it's obviously been amazing to work with all these different people and just to be in a position to be able to help support you know other small local businesses that are local to me so i'm very excited actually to release like you know the to to because currently the store is closed but I'm very excited for the store's reopening and to show everyone what I've been working on and you know I can only tell you that it's only up from here um, so yeah thank you for listening to my story obviously if you have any questions about you know the business and, and stuff like that or my journey and my experience then please don't forget to, I mean don't hesitate to um, you can e email me at hello at mercysmain.co.uk or you can send us a dm at at mercysmain or you can find us on facebook or instagram and i'd be happy to answer any of your questions and stuff like that so yeah thanks for listening to my story so i hope the story has been a blessing to you as much as it has been to me um the proverbs that one woman everybody every one of us can relate to it especially if you're a christian and if you're not a christian if you just google proverbs chapter 31 you are going to see a rundown of the whole you know, the whole chapter from where she got this in um this amazing you know um idea from and how the lord has helped her grow over the years you know so if you're there and the lord is speaking to you to start a business start a business you don't know how far it will go if the lord is saying to you start a youtube channel the space is so big it can contain everybody if the lord is ministering to you to you know to do something don't delay delay is dangerous so yeah i hope you have watched up to this point i thank you so much for your time before you leave don't forget to comment like and subscribe let me know in the comment section below your health care your healthy afro air routine so we can learn together this channel is all about sharing community spirit you know caring for one another and helping each other grow so thank you so much once again but whatever you do make sure you keep going keep moving and don't stop till i see you next time bye